You're watching Fox 31 Cable Channel 7. It's 10 o'clock. Time for news. Now, from Fox 31, this is Rochester's only live 10 o'clock newscast. Fox News First. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. Tom has a night off. First on Fox tonight, the anticipation and preparation is now over. Bonnie has arrived. You're watching Fox News First, Rochester's 10 o'clock news with Donna Didi, Tom Butler, meteorologist Howard Bernstein, and John DeTulio with Fox Sports. 17 people are injured, including six children, after a house explosion in a Boston suburb. Live from Fox Rochester, this is the 10 o'clock news. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sherman Burnett. And I'm Christine Persichetti. Donna has the night off. You're watching the 10 o'clock news on Fox Rochester with Donna Didi, Sherman Burdett, Chief Meteorologist Michael Gouldrick, and John DeTulio with Sports Extra. Parents of some 7th graders are racing... I'm Melanie Barnes. Tonight, how one local community could be affected by health care changes. Plus, the future for talk show host Bob Lonsberry. And I'm Morris Jones. Arnold gives up the movies for live TV tonight. We'll check in on his first and maybe last debate. And should all military Muslims be suspects? Barnes. Up next, Monroe County leaders are looking to track sex offenders with a GPS device. I'm Morris Jones. Also coming up, a public apology to African Americans. Lawmakers say sorry for failing to act in the past. Plus, sing Saddam for the first time in a year. But first, the jury returns a verdict in the trial for the King of Pop, Michael Jackson. Television studios in Rochester, New York. This is Fox. First at 10. Good evening. I'm Leah Lando. First on Fox. Strong thunderstorms are sweeping through our area at this hour, and many residents are without power tonight. The From the WUHF Television Studios in Rochester, New York. This is Fox. First at 10. Good evening, I'm Leah Lando. First on Fox tonight, a split decision in the trial of a former Monroe County Sheriff's deputy. From the WUHF television studios in Rochester, New York, this is Fox First at 10. And first on Fox tonight, the Apple iPhone has been a hot topic this week. From WUHF TV, this is Fox Rochester News, first at 10 in high definition. Good evening. The holiday season is finally underway. Just 31 more shopping days to go until Christmas. You're watching Tina Shively, meteorologist Stacy Pingen, and sports with Thad Brown. This is Fox Rochester News, first at 10 in high definition. You're watching Fox Rochester. From the 13 Wham News Studios, this is Good Day Rochester. Good morning. It's 8 o'clock on this Monday, <clears throat> March 10th. Our piano player sounds good. I know. It's Fox Rochester. And this is Good Day Rochester. New this morning, a violent end to the weekend in Rochester as police respond to at least five shootings in just over five hours. Plus, the ambulance service in a local community has shut down. There's concern among neighbors in Avon about emergency response times under the new arrangement. We'll tell you about that as we say good morning. Welcome to the broadcast. This is Good Day Rochester on Fox Rochester. This is Monday, April 8th. I'm Jennifer Johnson. Yes, thanks for joining us. I'm Alexis Arnold. You're watching Fox Rochester. And this is 13 Wham News at 10. 
Back at the scene of the crime, tonight deputies return to where a woman was hit by a car in Penfield last week. They're hoping someone may have seen something. And then I went about doing things and the next thing I know I look out the window and there's flashy lights, sirens. Good evening, I'm Ginny Ryan. That woman says the victim, Jessica Fox, pulled over in her driveway several times that night to help a stranded friend along busy Penfield Road. Channel 31, Cable 7, WUHF-TV, Rochester.